Hey, what's up guys? This is BubbaTV24 and welcome to the channel. Today I am in the game My Water Park Tycoon in Roblox. And as the title suggests, I think we are building a water park. And so uh, I don't know if water parks are open right now. I mean, I assume that they are maybe because of pandemic stuff. I don't know how that stuff actually works. I haven't been to a water park in a very long time, but I'm not opposed to them. I think they're pretty great. Uh, but since uh, it's a little bit too cold right now where I live for water park shenanigans because we're getting into summer It's still spring and it's not exactly like blazing hot here So water parks are not something that I'd be willing to jump into right now Anyway, we're gonna build one in Roblox instead if you guys enjoy these types of videos Please be sure to hit like on it feel free to subscribe so you know when new stuff is coming out we are on pace now for 2,900 subscribers. We just hit 2,800. That is all thanks to you guys. Thank you for being a subscriber and for sticking around and showing up to the channel. I really do appreciate it. Let's keep the momentum going. We'll go to 2,900. We'll try to do that. And at 3,000, I will make a special announcement regarding the channel that I have already made in a previous video, but we'll make it an official thing. Uh, but if you want to leave a comment, be sure to go to my Twitter. It's at BubbaTV24. Link in the description down below. You can leave your comments. You can leave your um, game suggestions. They do not need to be in Roblox as long as they are family friendly. So that's all there is to it. We are going to build a water park. Uh, as you can see, I'm making a dollar every, was it $10 a second? I've got some money, but everything I think that I buy boosts my cash gain by one maybe something like that these are all relatively cheap so i'm just kind of buying a little bit of everything um to start off with if you guys don't know how i do my tycoons i try to do as much as i can in one sitting if i can finish it that's great if not then if we hit i don't know like 10 likes or something on the video that lets me know to do the next part of it because if people don't really want to watch it then there's no point in doing another one but that needs to be shown by likes or dislikes because that is just uh that's that's all i have really since i can't have comment sections uh thanks to what youtube has done with kids channels so that is where we are at uh please youtube you guys need to come up with some sort of system to allow me to have comments because it's just it's easier for me to communicate here with you all than it is for you all to go to twitter uh but twitter is really the only option that i have uh, outside of uh, just going against all of YouTube's rules and marking myself as a not for kids channel even though that is not what I am uh, so okay get for zero so we can build an option here so we're gonna do building let's do a drinks building everybody needs a drink right uh, sure uh, so we have our first dude here this isn't really a water park so much as it is like a, just a regular park with some money in here some uh, drink options get some money here so we got ourselves up to $25 a second pretty cool we're gonna keep building this up uh, I don't know how this must be pretty big like you could kind of see where some of the things are gonna be built here so I assume this is, should be or will be a fairly large area so since we have drinks uh, what is this ice cream let's do burgers first We'll do the main foods. We'll do food and then food and drink, and then we can do dessert. Oh, so we can't buy it because it's uh, ice cream is for Robux. Okay, might as well get some pizza action in there. Dude, pizza's so darn good. Um, let's do more burgers. Burgers and pizza. That's how it is. Pizza is delicious. Uh, favorite topping for me, I just man, I am simple. I love a simple pepperoni pizza. I do like stuffed crust pizza though, but I do love just a simple pepperoni and cheese pizza. Something about it is just, it just hits the spot, you know. Sometimes I like sausage, you know, I like other things on there, sure. But man, pepperoni pizza, good pepperoni pizza. Ooh, man, just hits the spot, dude. Um, uh, yeah, uh, favorite pizza place though. I you know, I don't know. I'm, I've been I've been torn on this one. Uh, there's a uh, you know, I don't really like Domino's or Pizza Hut. I've had some bad experiences with them. I think that uh, you know, Pizza Hut has been consistently sort of like bad for me. Domino's has been kind of hit and miss for the most part. Uh, Papa John's. 
is okay. It, it's, you know, it's not the best, but it does sort of, it has been consistently good, I would say. And then there's another chain uh, called Marco's that I actually really like. Um, and I know some people might be saying, ew, it's not, not your thing. But honestly, Marco's, like, every time I've ever been there, ever gotten anything from it, been amazingly good. Um, hasn't been an issue for me. Um, you know, some local chains around here I'm not going to go into, but some local chains that are uh, pretty good also for the most part. And yeah, so pizza is just, you know, you know what, pizza is just good. But I'll tell you what, the best place for pizza are like these sort of like rickety hole in the wall places that you wouldn't expect to see. They're just kind of out in the middle of nowhere or whatever. We've got a couple places around here like that. And they're fantastic pizza places. So, you know, I mean, if a place looks disgusting, don't go there. But it, but you never know. Like, some of these, like, little hole-in-the-wall diners and places are some of the best places to get food. Those people are just crazy good at what they do. Uh... Yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay, I've talked about food for most of this video, and really, I'm just buying sort of like a, um, it looks like a gift shop sort of area. So, this place is going to get big, I think, and so what's probably going to end up happening here is I'm going to go ahead and uh, continue to get money and continue to buy stuff, and then what we'll do is we'll cut ahead to near the end of the, the the tycoon or at the end of the tycoon and I'll show you everything there is to buy give you a little bit of a walkthrough and if I can remember I forgot to do it last time uh, if I remember I'll try and tell you how long it took me to actually complete the tycoon so in case you want to play it yourself you'll know how long it takes to do uh, and that's pretty much it so I'll see you guys here in just a little bit alright guys we have completed the water park Fun little story, I'm going to give you guys a little behind the scenes here. Uh, I already beat this game once, um, and I accidentally hit Rebirth, and guess what? I hit Rebirth, and I started all over again, didn't mean to do it, and I forgot to show you guys all of the stuff that, was, uh, that had happened. And so, um, I was desperately trying to then play the game again, to show you the ending, stopped recording because I had to leave, and then when I came back, it had not saved any of my new progress, but instead has put me at the end of the original game that I played before I rebirthed. So I was able to actually just come back to the end of it. So I only wasted, you know, uh, most of my time. Um, <laughs> uh, in all, it took me about an hour and 45 minutes in that area to finish this. I'm going to give you guys a little walkthrough here real quick and show you everything that's going on. So we are at the water park here. I don't think I have a rebirth. Nope. Okay, so it didn't even count the rebirth that I did. It says here that it's uh, my progress is at 97%, but there is absolutely no way for me to actually finish this progress. That's uh, a bit of an issue. So we're going to go in here. So we have our starting area, the area that you guys saw originally. We've got the pizza, the burgers, the drinks, and the burgers again, because burgers are amazing, and so is pizza, but you know, burgers are like really, really good too. Uh, we've got our little pool noodle shop with inner tubes and pool noodles and stuff like that. We come over here. There is a lazy river all along the outside of this area. Unfortunately, there's no way for you to like ride anything in it. Now. Here's the water park. Now there are like a couple that are very similar to this and all of these slides you can ride if you really really want to. So you can come up here and just come down, you'll go limp and then you'll slide down, go into the water. Little water areas and all the, there are a bunch of like different slides so all these slides are kind of like different in their own way. Different colored and that kind of thing. So they all kind of act in the same way. Uh, you kind of just climb to the top just like any slide and then you go down it. I was kind of expecting or at least hoping for more intricate slides, kind of like the ones where you go in down like the, uh, you know, the inner tubes and stuff when they've, they've got like these really crazy like slides you can go down and stuff like that. Um, 
maybe even have a theme like a pirate slide or something you know none of that really here um so you do have this kind of slide which is kind of like a bowl slide this would not fly in real life i don't think i think people would get injured on a slide particularly like this without some sort of inner tube or whatever as you can see i just ragged all down it looked like i may have broken my neck <laughs> um over here is like a weird set of offices i don't really understand the point of this building you go in here there's a desk there's cubicles and then there's like meeting rooms and stuff like that i don't really see the point of this this doesn't really fit the theme of a water park in my opinion that's just me uh a lot of like npcs that run around they like to go and go up on the slides and stuff like that all the slides kind of do the same thing and then we've got uh, another area back here with more slides. Um, all these slides basically do the same thing uh, again. Uh, they aren't any really any different. They aren't like intricate or have any loops or stuff like that. They just, you know, you go up and then you go down. That's it. Um, so that's the thing. But like I said, it took about an hour. I can't even get in this one. What? So like I said, it took about an hour 45 to complete it and uh so you know if you're um wanting to play this for yourself that's about how long you're gonna have to put into it to actually finish the whole thing uh rebirthing if you hit rebirth it does restart everything uh you get your own you get rebirth only buttons and a rebirth tool which i think is actually this one um and then you can go and uh you also get a little bit of extra income uh, the problem is it sets up at 97%. However, if I click rebirth here, it will rebirth. So I don't really know if maybe this is messed up a little bit or something like that, but um, I'm not sure, but it's a thing. Uh, so that's pretty much it. If you guys enjoyed this tycoon, you want to see more of it, please. Well, not of this one, but if you want to see more tycoons, please be sure to hit like on the video and I'll know to do more of them. Also, be sure to go to my Twitter and leave a comment there or a game suggestion there. It's at BubbaTV24, link in the description. And also, if you want to uh, subscribe, that helps me out a lot. We have hit 2,800 subs. You guys are amazing. Thank you so much for, uh, for everything for subscribing and coming by and watching the content and i hope you guys are really enjoying it because um you know i have a good time making it i like a lot of these games and uh i hope you guys um are enjoying what i'm putting out and that and you know uh we'll keep doing it uh at 3000 i have a bit of an announcement but we got to get there first so i'm not trying to like you know count what do they call it put my count my duck i was gonna say count my ducks before they hatch but uh something i'm not gonna get ahead of myself that's what i'm trying to say so uh if if we hit 3k if when we hit 3k thanks to you all uh then we'll uh, be able to make some changes here at the channel for the better uh and yeah so that's pretty much it i will see you guys next time i've been bubba tv 24 and i am signing out